Welcome back to Earlham, everybody. We are kicking off high school football in a big way. Van Meter is coming to town. They say no dogs allowed, right, Earl? Not today. Earl the Cardinal is ready to go. Matt McCulloch is standing by with the football coaches to find out just how they're getting ready for a big week one showdown. Matt? Yes, absolutely, Elias. Thank you so much. Joined here by head coach, Coach Kasky, and assistant coach. Coach Kasky, we'll start with you. Uh, how big is it uh, for you guys to get out of the gates week one with, with Van Meter, the defending 1A champions? Oh, I think it's always good to start fast. Um, first five minutes of this game is going to be huge and figuring out how to play a game speed, and then mm -hmm. once we get into it, I think of things will be fine. How has preparation been for you guys kind of leading up to week one? I know for head coaches, it's always uh, kind of you'll, you'll see, you don't really know what to expect week one. Do you know what to expect going into this game? Um, absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> we have uh, we lost a pretty good senior class, and, and I think we got some great kids coming back. Um, but they haven't been under the fire yet. Uh, I think Van Meter's in the same boat. Mm -hmm. They lost a good senior class and mm -hmm. had a great year last year. and. They're extremely well coached, so you know you're going to get their best shot. In a one-point game a year ago, we've already talked about that, and uh, now your, your son, uh, he's going to be starting quarterback uh, this year. How, how are you feeling as a dad and also as a head coach? I'm feeling pretty good because he's just got to hand it off. We don't. We try not to <laughs> That's throw. That's it. That easy, huh? Yeah, we try not to throw it very much. So yeah. as long as he hands it to the right guy, we're in good shape. Well, and he's going to be able to do that with uh, the big boys up up front. Uh, talk about that offensive line. Uh, Coach Cassie was telling me they average about 250 pounds. That's right. huge. It, it is. Um, really, what I try to do is just make sure that they're. And it doesn't really do very good if they're not you know, low and also in the right spot. So that's really what I try and do is just make sure that we're always working on being in the right position. We have good technique. Um, we've been working on that for about a month now. So hopefully we're doing that tonight and we give high effort. And if we do that, then good things will happen. Do you guys have a lot of good leaders uh, on this team? I think so. Um, our senior class has been around it. Um, they've learned from the ones before them what to do, what not to do. And I think every senior class comes in and they get to use that. Mm -hmm. This one's no different. And this is a natural born rivalry, right? I mean, a lot of these kids, they played the kid, the boys over at Van Meter since they were in third grade. Uh, kind of talk about that aspect of it. Um, yeah, it's moving here. It was, it was extremely tough because you'd, you try to get the kids up for every game mm -hmm. and not just one in particular. Right. And it seems like this is the one that everybody wants to win. And sometimes they might lose every other one, but this is the one they want to get and trying to convince them that, you know, this game is like no other. I mean, yeah, they're close, and yeah, you know them, but you also know the kids from Madrid and the kids from Pleasantville, and so right. this one shouldn't be any different. All right, big game, week one. Well, I still send it back to you. All right, yeah, the baton has been passed on, and hopefully some uh, new leadership here, new blood. We do have more coming your way on Blitz Game Day. We'll let the spirit take it away here from Earlham. We are live, and we're coming back with Blitz Game Day.